I don't know about you, but I would never go to a salon for a hairstyle change without first getting a consultation. So if you would never consider changing your hairstyle without first consulting with your stylist for fear you could end up with yellow or even pink hair, then why is choosing art for our homes any different? The art on our walls is there day in and day out, for years, even for decades. Shouldn't it be chosen as thoughtfully and strategically as a hairstyle? One thing I noticed as a muralist for many years was that using the colors in a client's home, literally pulling in their wall colors, the trim color, any other colors from the space, resulted in a cohesiveness that was really stunning. In fact, with almost every mural, the comment from the client was that they felt it pulled the room together or even the whole home together. So I've taken that same technique and implemented it with my custom commissions. I want to see everything that my clients have in their home. The way we do that is by starting out on a Zoom call and seeing the space where their art's going to go, as well as as much uh, of your home as possible. I would like to know your wall colors, any accent colors, and see the other art that you own or art that you love. You can see here that in addition to the video that I have of the client's home interior, I also use photos and paint chips to keep me focused on the space. Is your home filled with art that inspires you, that reminds you of happy things, great times, or do you struggle with adding color or even knowing what colors to introduce? Maybe you need an unusual size for a very unique space. If you feel like you just can't find the right art for your space, or maybe you just want to be thoughtful and not impulsive about what you put on your walls, then let's talk about what you envision. I only take on a few commissions a year, so click here and we can chat about your space and we can talk about what your dreams are for your walls.